Hey there, Erin from Morehouse Farm here, and I'd like to introduce you to steam blocking. So, you know about wet blocking, where you give your project a bath, because, hey, if you're gonna wear it, you are gonna wash it, I hope, and you wanna see how that performs at that point, so why not give it a test bath? And this one is a really neat way to lay out Fair Isle stitches and even them out by simply putting down your iron on the steam setting. And see how crinkly that is right there? Let's put the iron over it, flatten it out, give it a couple of shots of steam, and look at how well those all evened out nice and flat now. And we're in the poor light of my kitchen because it's a rainy day here in New York. But look at that. It's a little trickier with a hat because you do have to be able to work through the curves. So what I like to do is just push the iron around from the point of the crown, kind of being where everything combines. And if I end up wrinkling it, not the end of the world, that's where we can iron it out again. And then don't forget to do the other side. And you may find that you want to take the crown, which, let me brag on this pattern for a minute, Wilma Malcolmson, Katie's cap. Isn't that a gorgeous crown? I love the way that comes together. She did such a fantastic job here. This is the official pattern of Shetland Wool Week 2020, so if you haven't gotten it, get it now. They could use a donation, too, along the way, so that they can run an even better festival when we're out of COVID. And I hope to be able to get there someday. So happy to support them, their project, this fantastic pattern, knit with two skeins of Morehouse Merino two-ply sport, super squishy, lofty sport weight yarn that can be knit down to the seven-ish stitches per inch gauge here, and all the way up to three if you really want to get creative with it, but what an awesome cap. So here you go. Happy knitting from Morehouse Farm.